and action. Hi, so guess where we are? This has been our home for five days and we are at the Sadhguru which is in Uruli, just a few kilometers away from Pune. Let's go inside. Come on, come on, come on. family homes uh, which are also called as kutum nivas okay it's a marathi word so that's that and these are the four gardens that you can see out here there are so many cats in this area in this spot one the tracks are just beside this as i sit here and read my book this is the library of this place different kinds of homes are available for patients to stay you know for residents to stay like neeman kuti sharapur and what not there are so many different kinds of places you can choose to stay depends on the availability also and this again is a very nice and greenish garden kind of thing which they have built and it gives you a feeling of freshness Just look at it how beautiful it is all day you can see For yoga in the morning at 6:15 for 45 minutes, and there are some few lectures which go on the whole day or the evening, which you can just attend. And they are not boring at all. Not yeah. at all. Yeah. People go here in the evening. Let's see that side. 
It's lush green and the snow is in my teeth and coming. What lies ahead? Uh, we usually take our evening walks over here, and this is very beautiful in the evenings as there is less sun, <laughs> of course. And uh, by the way, uh, can you please tell what happened yesterday evening? Over here. What happened exactly in the evening? It started raining, drizzling, and we were just walking amidst this blue sky and this green environment, and we were feeling so earthy. Yeah, and by the way, because of this uh, mud over here, uh, you all know, right? When water falls on it, when it get w when it gets wet, uh, the smell. Oh my God, we can't just resist it. It's so beautiful. It's so aromatic. And that's why we love this route. Indeed it is. That we are showing you. And you should and you must come here. Not for anything, just for your peace and your calm. And some healthy food. Yeah. If you are a party kind of person, <laughs> please don't come here. No, 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 I'm just kidding. Even if if you are a party kind of person, if you like peace, if you don't get bored with yourself, you know, you can remain, uh, you can choose to remain uh, quiet and peaceful. And if you like that, this is the place for you. I think everyone at least once should experience the peacefulness of this place. Get to know themselves better. It's a nice introspection therapy which happens at this place, naturally. I know. There is also a therapy which is called a sunburn therapy. If you come here in the afternoon, you will get a nice headache. When you go inside your room, you will get a nice sleep. So, you can feel the pain. You can also enjoy your sleep. And now, uh, Another bench, another favorite spot of ours, which we usually sit on the afternoons like these, okay? You must be imagining so much heat and where do you choose to sit? Just have a look at this place. which we saw at Pojan Group. And then we start our treatments. Treatments like anima. It is quite funny because you know what anima is? I'll tell you in simple words. It is a pipe which goes up to your bum and they pour very not hot but little warm neem kapani and which cleans your colon and your intestines. And then, after it's done, you feel the pressure. So you have to tell them, stop, 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 stop. Then they remove the pipe and you have to rush to the washroom to poop it out. <laughs> the next treatment is massage, which is my favorite because we relax. We have various oils which we can use for massaging. I use still oil and baby oil and it was quite nice. The next is mati lep on your stomach. What mati lep is? put a heap of mitti on our stomach and then you feel cool cool and then you have to let it dry off and after it's dried you have to go and wash it. What it leads to is you, less, you feel less hungry and it cools you down. The next therapy is steam which is a compartment sort of a thing like a box where you have to sit and they put hot steam 
above you and over you so you start sweating and that's how you reduce calories after that you have to take a cold shower because it is very hot after that you have to do upward which is baths with soap and then you can chill and at 12 and at 10:30 i come here for lunch which i just had which was a bale of sprouts beetroot tomatoes cucumber and what not and drumstick soup i know and then you have to sleep then let's show you where i am living At 3 o'clock, I wake up and have my kada, which is with milk, by the way. Kada is a nice hot water filled with tulsi and ginger and lemongrass, poured with a pinch of jaggery water and milk, and it tastes delicious. You should try it, and you should come for that. After that, I have to take my belt, la belt, which is a belt. cold water which we have to tie and above that there is a tight belt which we you know give a knot and for 30 minutes we have to keep it at rest and after that i have to take a steam because i have cold steam of nilgiri water and then i'm practically done at 5:30 i have my dinner which is not a snack and for dinner i have soup sabji with salt let's show where i'm living He is the lady complaining about her home. <laughs> and this is the this is the akpati, which is for your eyes to make it cool. And this is the sandas, and this is the bathroom where you have to go to. And this is where you have to use bath. Hey. And that is a nice area to chill because you know. And this is called. Yakti Nevas, weekend. That's it. See you. Bye bye. bye. bye.